Hi, everybody. Okay, so <clears throat> check it out. I haven't looked at it yet. You can look at it with me. All I did was uh, rinse it out for a good long while. And then I took some shampoo. And uh, lucky for me, I got the big bottle from Costco. So it's a Pantene 5-in-1. And I didn't use the conditioner. I just used the shampoo. But I knew I was going to have I need some sort of conditioner. What I did is I poured a lot. I mean, I put a big old chunk in the bag, big old chunk on the, all over. And... Um, and I started on the edges, added a little water here and there, and just worked it into the into until it was it felt like it was so thick, thick lather with little bubbles, not big bubbles. And then I worked it until uh it, it was it just went everywhere and I just left it on there for a few minutes, still massaging it, massage massaging my scalp, um, and uh making sure that, you know, if it was itchy somewhere I got it good, you know, not just scratched it. Um, cause usually that means that the, you got some burning going on there because you got some product in there and oh my gosh, my hair feels great. My scalp feels perfect. And uh, one thing is, you know, um, when I was trying to take off that stuff, I forgot to remove it beforehand, but it, uh, it, it, it eventually came off. What did you see? Little wipes. Oh, look at that. Look, look at that. Ooh. Hope th <laughs> Please tell me that's not just me being bleached. Wait, <laughs> my tan got bleached. So anyway, um, one thing that happened, <laughs> I forgot, because I'm so new to it. I've only done it like three times. And I bought these. These are uh, fake eyelashes. I forgot to take them off. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. I had to reach out and take them off. And and then um, I couldn't get all of this. So I'm trying to figure out how to get that off. If anybody out there has knows of a simple product I can use, let me know. Okay, um, so that being said, let's put y'all up here. Gotta get everything out of my trusty thing. I'm gonna put it all back in there to keep it nice and tight. Very nice. You can't see the dial quite, but let's see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? I like it. I mean, um, it might. I don't know if I wore it, if I would care too much about the little blondie. I don't really because, you know. A little natural I and mean, I've always learned in art that mistakes are not bad sometimes they can make it art and uh, so yeah hey man I ain't gonna lie I kind of like this color myself maybe I should just wear it for a day as I do some videos you know make myself look a little beach girl the beach girl mm -hmm pink a little it's left in there but um let's not say we did okay <laughs> okay so i'm just gonna let it dry out because oh, oh, oh look at that i see a dark spot is it too dark should i give it another go around i don't really like doing that because like i said i did buy four of them so i'm only planning on using two this time around but I did buy four in case I needed to do another one. So I have enough. Um, and if I if I need more than than two, which I used three last three just now to do the, all this, and I didn't think it was enough either. I could always use the other two boxes, and then you know, if it doesn't come out as good as possible, then I can just go buy four more. Um, ooh. <sighs> Don't scratch. Just uh, there we go. Oh. 
I like it. I like it. I like it. Little makeup on. Cute little dress. And nice little video to say, what up, American people? Proud to be an American, even today, as much as I did yesterday. Well, America, I'll do another video, um, part three, when I would do the other one, okay? Peace out.